Welcome back to more of my let's play of Hi Hi Puffy. I'm Yumi Kaznap, and now we're in World 5, BC. Somehow. How did we go back in time? Ami, Yumi, you got some explaining to do. Uh, I guess it's just logic. Again, cartoon logic. Also, World 5 is very unique. Not just because of the entire aesthetic, including dinosaurs that want to nom my face off. He's like, yeah, I want to nom you. I'm hungry. I'm a dinosaur. You know, I'm a T-Rex. I was like, I just nearly dodged that. I'm Indiana Jones. Or... Indiana Army! Never mind! I, I let myself down. <laughs> Come on, Ami, get up there! How could you not get up there, Ami? Like, you had a triple jump! You can triple jump! You have five physics! Like, you know how you can normally triple jump on me? Well, guess what? That's not something that normal protagonists have. Sometimes I can only jump once. Or maybe even twice. But never, ever three times. Well, except in one game, and that game is actually pretty uh, notorious for all the glitches it has. It has. Wow, that's perfect grammar, isn't it? It's perfect grammar! I know grammar! Also, this alcove was kind of pointless, wasn't it? It was just for one note. And, um, yeah, you're gonna be noticing something, and, uh, uh, <laughs> nice try. Oh. Super nice try. Oh, that actually reminds me of something. Like, there's some games that can actually punish you for putting in cheat codes, and I actually really enjoy that. It's like, yeah, you, you try and cheat on this game, we're going to make sure we let you know that we're not pulling any punches. We're going to mess around with you. And also, there are some bosses that absolutely cheat like nuts. Like, they're like absolute cheetahs. I don't like them. Like, um, I don't like those kinds of bosses where they're like, Oh, oh, I was supposed to take damage? Well, guess what? I didn't notice, so that didn't count. Ugh, I hate those bosses. Thankfully, this game does not have any. Like, it has some pretty cool bosses, by the way. Like, those, like... Seriously, a dinosaur thing, and I noticed I actually did hit its tail. Like, I hit the tip of its tail, and then eventually after hitting it enough times, I actually stopped showing its tail. Like, each hit on its tail gave me 10, well, not 10, it gave me 20 points, but it did not deal any damage to the boss. Looks like bosses have some kind of special, like, point on them you can actually hit for extra points, but it doesn't deal any damage to them. Also, JK. Totally lovable cat for the win. Push. Push. Yeah, you, even though Ami can't damage these robots, but she can put them into humiliating situations. Like this right here. Oh. Hey, you. Boom. Now stay right there. No, no you get this. Where you come up here. Stay. Stay. Good robot. Now play dead. <laughs> Boom. Yeah, wait. I need that note. Oh, I need to put this onto the elevator first. Boom. Also, I hear people cutting out a tree outside. Uh, obviously, the rock wanted to intervene in my plan. It's like, no, we will not let you do this because we're rocks. Uh, I don't know. It, I, I really like rocks. Especially Rock Pikmin from the you know, Pikmin series. I really like Pikmin. And, um,. I have a thing I like, I, ever since I found out about Pikmin, I thought they were so adorable. And then, I have this habit of whenever a single Pikmin dies, no matter what it is too, either due to my own fault or just an enemy being an absolute jerk to me, I reset to the previous save point. And that previous save point happens to be a place where a Pikmin has not died yet. So yeah, I like doing that. And I like game, like, revenge on my enemy. Huh. 
Much like King Nidity did in Kirby Superstar Ultra. You know, Mask Nidity. Oh, that was pain. That was a pain to fight. Ugh. And, um, yeah, in case you haven't already noticed, I have not picked a certain thing up. Like, we have been gathering the notes. But, um, there's something else. Also, we have Banana. And now, pay attention to what's gonna be in that corridor. You might be thinking it's gonna be, like, something really special, like, you know that certain collectible we've been collecting every single time we've been in a level uttered into 33 notes in each? This world's gonna flip that logic on its head. Nope. Also, those little small rocks indicate where guys are gonna be popping up, but if you use a jazz, it destroys the rock. Logic! Wait. There's a dinosaur here. He's gone now. Oh! That's what I get for making a reference! I almost got punished for making a reference to... Uh, I almost got punished for making a reference to Silent Hill. Uh, everything's out to get me now because I made a reference! See what I mean? And, um, you might be thinking it's gonna be that supposed to collectible. No, it's just Jank Kang again. But, um... Yeah, it's just Jank Kang again. Remember this area for later on. Because we will be revisiting this area and the prize that's going to be waiting there is not going to be Jank Kang, but something else. Run away! <laughs> you almost got me, but you didn't! Look at him, he's like, no! I want to eat you! I am a big, scary T-Rex! I am hungry! No, you got away! I don't know how you did it, but you did! Now we're going to be in the Dino Rampage! <laughs> And again, just to get the notes alone is just tedious. Uh, spiders. Push. Oh, I can't just push them. I just have to smack them in the face. No. No. Wow! They're doing it a lot more often. That was epic. I fought those robots like a champ. Like a champ. I am a champion. I keep on pressing A. I meant to press R. Uh, I keep on mixing up buttons on my Game Boy Advance. How do I do that? Also, jank again. But, um, no, 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 don't come, don't come to me. I'm here to point out something. Uh, yeah, you see that? To... Either JK has mastered the art of cloning or something else. But yeah, there's two Jankings. How does that make sense? It doesn't! But why did I start running? That made no sense. Yep. No, oh, I, I, I apparently do not know the directions. I am lost in a cave. Surprisingly, no dinosaurs yet, only spiders. Do spiders count as dinosaurs? Maybe. Also, I hear a chainsaw outside. Hopefully nothing's coming to kill me. Haha, yeah. ah you missed. Boom. 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 Hey. Boom. Okay, well pretend that hit me, because it obviously did not. Boom. How'd you not get destroyed? Yeah, there's like just a bunch of block puzzles. And um, yeah, I have a practice recording of this area. Like this world. And um, it took 50 minutes. Puzzles getting clobbered by everything. Yeah. Like, Spider, do you mean to be upset at me? Are you just defending your territory? I bet you're just defending your territory. You're like, no, you will stay away from my territory. It's my territory. My love. And I understand that. Like, you have to defend your, your property. But you don't have to be so aggressive. I don't know how I got hit there. Or how did I even dodge the spider in the first place. But um, we're just pretend that works. Why didn't you... I guess he just likes... Yumi... When she does extremely cool things. Such as that. He's like... 
I can't attack you now. You just did something amazing. You just proved to me that you are not just no mere person. You are awesome. And, um, oh yeah, this block. Push the block. Boom. Yay. Come on. You may dash. Yeah. There's robots. But wait. <gasps> oh no, it's an arena! No, it's no, nothing but an arena. How will ever, however, I deal with these four robots? Oh, that's out. <clears throat> <laughs> well, they're pathetic. They didn't last long. And um, yeah, World Five is the only one where I actually have like more than one instance of Jank Kang being present, so you can get two extra lives. But that hasn't happened before, has it? And there's a very good reason. It's a reason the game doesn't even give you. But you're down for the count. <laughs> Wait, where am I supposed to be going? That chainsaw is really loud, by the way. Like, seriously, I hope you guys can't hear it. Boom. Boom. Oh, I could have crushed the robot. Why didn't I do that? Um, hit the switch. <clears throat> oh, my throat feels sore. I gotta get some water after this. Because I love water. It's really good. It's good, but... Like, seriously, sometimes it get kind of boring. Like, water can be kind of boring. But you can, like, do multiple things to water. Like, you can just, like, just add some flavor to it. Um... Probably... Sing opera while drinking water, I guess. That, that makes sense, right? Yep. Where am I supposed to be going now? There's a switch down there. There's two switches. One of them is a button switch. Which now I'm kind of curious. What happens if Ami or Yumi stand on it? Like, we never get to see that, do we? Yeah. Also, a fan. He's my number one fan! I was trying to play music for him, but it's like, no, you cannot do that. We won't let you. Robot! That was just bad. Boom. Looks like the guitar guy knocks him back slightly. Uh, jump, you me. You need to jump! The Those robots are gonna be posing a threat later on, I think. Uh, boom. Mm, boom. And now. Yep! Like, seriously, you me and Ami are both adorable, aren't they? You can't tell me they aren't! If you do, you'll be blind yourself. <clears throat> oh, my throat. Again. Again, it's clogged. Which reminds me of certain, like, something like... Do, do any of you use, like, drain clearing products? Like, do you even trust those kinds of things? Like, it says it'll clear the, your, your drain, like your sink drain, but will it really? I mean, it... They, some of the commercials are just straight, like, extremely exaggerated. Like, even giving, like, the, the clog itself a personality, and that just kind of makes me feel uncomfortable. Also, here's notes. But we can't get them. Okay. Why'd I switch? I was trying to get up there, but I couldn't. Boom. Yay. But that opens that up. The Again, I forget that only Yumi can triple jump. Huh. Much like a certain other pink character that I know. Do you know? Hint, her name is like Ami, but it has a Y at the end. Also, her last name is Rose. I bet you guys can't guess. Or you can. Also, we got all the notes. Um, now all we have to do is just get to the end. Which I am confused about. How do I get to the end again? I, I did practice this, guys. I know what I'm doing. For the most part. Boom. I like his face when I stun him like that. Oh, robot. Ha! You're too slow. I probably upset at some people by saying that. Boom. 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 No. You do not. Rev up. And dash at me. Like a car. You can't do that. Boom. 
Like, seriously, I... Okay, I have a theory on... Like, I have a very intriguing theory. Like, if someone made, like, a crossover thing, like, between, uh... Hi, hi, Puffy, I'm Yumi and Kirby. Uh, <laughs> collateral damage, thy name is Kath, robot. Boom. 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 You fall down. You die. The end. You'll die now. Hey. Fine then. You'll die to this. You didn't want to get pushed down the pit like a noble robot. Instead, you want to get destroyed by music. It would have been much more noble if you had fallen out of pit. At least you could say you went out with dignity. But yeah, like, what copy ability would Kirby get from Ami or Yumi? And like. It's not gonna be like, you know, like, he just inhales them whole, like, just like, and just copies them that way. No, it's like, he'll, he'll try to inhale, but instead of like an, like, a, like an ability star will start forming, and then he'll inhale the ability star. Like, you know what ability stars are, right? They're like, those things that copy essences, like, you know, those things that give you copy abilities in Kirby? Yeah, those are, those are co copy ability stars. And, um, yeah, like, what ability would Kirby get? Like, would it be the mic ability, or maybe even an R ability? I don't know. Honestly, I think Kirby could, like, rock out with Ami and Yumi. Well, not with the mic ability, of course. Because, um, yeah, Kirby with the mic ability, one of the most devastating things in existence. Seriously, he took down Castle Deity just by singing. I'm not joking. Wait. I'm supposed to be going- I'm supposed to be going to the left, aren't I? To the left, to the left, to the left, to the left! I'm not gonna s start singing that. In fact, I don't even know the right- Get up there, Ami! Are you telling me you can't jump that high? Are you telling me, Jack? Like, I already pushed the block down, didn't I? Yeah, looks like it. That was just for Jang Kang. Um... I'm confused now, and also I don't know how to pronounce Jenkang or Dekarai, right? I think I am. Ha! It almost looked like I, I jumped on the spider, but I didn't. Yep. Ugh. Good job, Ami. Wait, where am I supposed to be going now? Um. Oh, my, my nose is itchy. Well. Well, not really my nose. Uh, did I hit the switch? I think I did. Did I? I don't think I hit this yet. No duh, Sherlock! Ugh. Come on, you- Boom! Down. Yep. Yeah. I keep on pressing down, I meant to press left. Also, doesn't Yumi just look amazing when she does it? It's like so cool. And um, even though the level is called Down Rampage, we did not see a single dinosaur. Odd. That was odd, wasn't it? Strange, isn't it? I should not be quoting that movie. Like, is that one Sonic Hedgehog movie? Is not the new one. Wait. Give me space. Yumi's face, you smiling, I saw that. Don't don't deny Yumi. You were having You're having a fun time just pushing that block. Cause you wanna show off how strong you are. Nothing will destroy you. You are invincible. You are a god or a goddess, depending on how you view it. And um I'm thinking of playing Kid Icarus on the channel. Like, maybe a uh, robot. Three, four, five, fire. Fire! Fire bad! It's very bad, because it's fire. Okay, dang. Wait, I destroyed him in one hit, I think? Or did I hit him multiple times with that? I'm not sure. Boom. Also, something intriguing about the block pushing.
Um, it did not do it there, but apparently whenever you pull the blocks, it actually contributes to the jam session meter, which is very odd. Yep. Also, I saw another fan like, how are these guys in prehistoric time? And even the robots, even the robots are in prehistoric time. Which makes no sense to me. Um, okay. I, I screwed up. I'm not supposed to be going this way. Boom. Boom. Also, jacking. Yep, I did not mean to hit you, sorry. Hopefully he will forgive me. Uh, I mean, um, how did it feel to have a platform just clip right into you? How did that feel? I bet it felt uncomfortable. About as uncomfortable as those spikes. Like, <laughs> I guess the first time I've ever seen it happen. Uh, what is he gonna? Oh, he's throwing a coconut. He's like, I'm going bowling! Oh no, coconut? Ow! Ah, I got hit in the head with a coconut! Ah, SpongeBob reference! SpongeBob reference for the win! I was about to close my heart. There. How's uh, that coconut? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, you was just taking those coconuts right to the face, and not even like being phased. Like, wow, Ami, that's amazing, and I think I just called her Yumi. Like I called her Yumi before I called her Ami. Wow, that's actually pretty sad. Also. Check your eye! Push the block before the coconut smacks me in the face. Uh, it actually bounced off the block. Good job, coconut. Also, watch out for this. Yeah! Lava bubbles! What are you doing out of Mario? What are you doing out of Mario? Huh? What are you doing? What are you doing? Lava bubble, what are you doing? Boom, 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 boom. Also, no robot. Guess what? Still has a surprise of his life. Dead. That was a surprise of his life. Or, unlife since I destroyed him. Uh, more robots. No, I'm not gonna destroy him the old fashioned way. I'm gonna destroy him using a. using a block. Because that's more epic. We rose that elevator. Hey guys, we're rising to the top! That was a terrible pun, and I know it. I'm surprised that they punished me yet for that pun. Usually I get punished for puns. Like a certain LP here. LP here being the one Chuck Conroy. Or if we're to led to believe by Super Paper Mario, Mimi Kids. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I remember that. Like, seriously, that was funny. Like, that was a funny little story you told us. That was pretty cool. And, wow, that robot really wanted to take the elevator. He's like, I'm taking the elevator to work, guys. Oh, no, I'm dead. Boom. <laughs> yeah, he got ran over from it by the back. Talk about backhanded tactics. Ah! Oh, that was terrible. Also, this block puzzle got me stumped for quite some time, but it's actually super easy. It's actually super easy. It's so easy, it's not even funny. Yeah, that's all you have to do for it. Boom. I like how she just punches the switch. Like, she just punches it. Why did you jump? Yumi, do not jump. Uh. Man, block. And again, it's janking again. How many lives do I have? I have at least, like, um, 14 right now, because I haven't died yet. Or, wait, I, I have I died yet? I'm not sure. Eh. 
and Ami looks a bit too happy to be in a room full of lava. Boom. Get her. I'm supposed to beat all of you up. But of course not the guys up there. No! Yay! Toy level cat. Can I run to the side of the spikes? Wait. I okay, it will let me do that. I thought it was a ceiling. But apparently no, it's like, oh, you want to crouch under these spikes? Well, guess what? If you stop crouching, you'll just impel your head on top of them. No biggie. It is a biggie. Uh, is that gonna hit me? You better not hit me. Because if you hit me, I'm gonna be upset. Yeah, I'm upset. Am I supposed to have this many notes? I think I am. Oh, there's the dinosaur again. He's like, I'm a dinosaur. Uh, ah, dinosaur. I got out. That looked painful. Ow. See what? Come on, give me the notes. Give me the notes. Stop hitting me! You still have it slack tight. Wow, I'm getting bullied by inanimate objects. Huh, just like my daily life. No, seriously, I actually have gotten hurt by a lot of inanimate objects. Like, I actually stepped on a leg at one time and my foot started bleeding. It was not fun. Also, we have all four notes. Cue the Banjo Kazooie theme for collecting all the notes in the world. Crawling, crawling, crawling. Also, Lava Bubble. My Lava Bubble. But I can't actually. Oh, I think Ami has to get up there and do it. Yeah. Sorry, Yumi, only Yami. No, Yami? No, that's, that's, a, that's one of my friend's names. Ah, that's funny. Ah, that's funny. And, uh, yeah, we got extra one for, you know, this world by getting all the notes, but you might have noticed something. I have not collected any instruments. That's because we can't get them right now. Not on this run through World 5, at least. Because the puffy extra you get from it is actually a spoiler to something. We'll be talking about that later. We got chill for a sec. We're going where no man has gone before. Another dimension? No, it's the moon. Sure, we'll be going to outer space. That makes sense, right guys? That makes sense. Not really. That robots. Boom. There's robots everywhere in space. In space, no one can hear you scream. Except the person sitting beside you. Ha, that was a reference to Sonic Colors. I hope I can play it for you guys one day. I actually like Sonic Colors. There's also Banana Aliens. Banalians! I came up with the name. You can't... You can't... Um... Um, what is it? Uh, wait, they actually fired a shot at me. Uh, diagonally? I think that's what they did. And, um, yeah, this is taking a lot less time than, uh, the, the other video. I have that saved. If you guys want to see it, feel free. Because I will post it if you guys want to see it and all my failures. Also, I will be doing another LP. I think. It's gonna be one, but yeah, they fired diagonally at me. Look at that. You. How did he hit me? I call shenanigans. I call shenanigans on the bananigans. Wow, that's. That's a phrase and a half. Can I not get bullied by bananas? Bananas! Everything's going bananas! No, it's a robot, they're all bananas! Imagine robot bananas, that would be kind of weird. Also, bananas are really weird, like, you can't, like, they don't grow normally. You have to plant, the, like, the seed on a stump in order for it to grow. It doesn't, like, you can't just plant a seed in the ground and it's just gonna grow. No, that, that's not, that's not how that works. Also, I got that robot by mistake, though. Wow, they're really making life miserable for me. Quit that, robots. <laughs> I found a safe spot, guys. Um, 
I just dodged all the bananas. Bananas! D Ow, I lost a life. And... Wait, I don't think I mentioned I wisely. No, I think I did. And what did that yield? That didn't yield anything. Oh, I do have two bombs ready. Uh, a heart! I'll be saving that for later. If I can. Um... I'll just use all my bombs here because all the bananas are over. Like, don't they look like they're wearing hockey masks? Wait, no, hockey masks. No, ski masks! Like, you know, you, you see a robbers wear sometimes? Where did I get hockey masks from? And, oh no! It's a UFO! Unidentified right, flying obstruction. Ha! Ah, you see what I did there? I. I. Yeah, obstructed because it's obstructing our way. It's keeping us from moving on. Also, you can hit the bottom of the thing in order to destroy it, but it doesn't, like, remove the UFO's ability to fire a laser beam at you. You know, it's like, I'm a fire on my laser! Come on, you gotta have a shoop the whoop face! Or at least make the shoop the whoop noise, like, Bleh! You can't just say nothing, UFO. You can't just say nothing. What's it doing? And, uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure I mentioned this before, but the Hi Hi Puffy Ami Yumi theme song is actually in English. Although it's actually rather hard to understand. Also, we're taking down his UFO. It's not really that durable, is it? You're not that durable, you UFO! Ha! Ah, you thought you could get me with a laser beam. But guess what you did? You thought you could be, like, a... A laser beam person, but you can't. <gasps> oh my god! What's that? What's that one thing? Oh my god! It's Ringus from Metroid! No! That means that we're fighting his mother brain! She has come back! She's not just wanting to destroy Samus. She's wanting to destroy Ami and Yumi too! Why? This makes no sense. Uh. Also, I'm doing... Dealing? No, I'm doing pretty good, despite having low health. Low health is understand. How did I not get hit by that? I will never know, nor will I ever question it. Well, I'm questioning it right now, but I stopped questioning it because I think I just stopped destroying the bananas because they keep on coming back. Like, I'll just leave one banana. There we go. Yeah, I think he's just gonna stay I, I think as long as I don't destroy all of them, they're not gonna respawn. Again, how do I not get hit by that? Asking all the really tough- Also, you only have like one hit left, don't you? No, nope, you have a few hits. Boom! Bye-bye. Bye-bye. My best Luigi impression. Also, when did I get help? I had at least one, didn't I? Also, we're going to be tackling the next world, which is the moon! Ooh, scary! It's the moon! Who would have guessed? Well, I mean, it's kind of like Xenoblade Chronicles, where if you see a place, you can most definitely reach it. Even if it means flying through space, which made no sense. And, um, so, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to see you guys next time. And until then, goodbye! Bye-bye!